Good day, one and all. We're back in the Keepers of the Void DLC where I am venturing into the stasis wing. Now, the stasis weapon is the one that I've got the least experience with. Oh, hello. I know what it does. Oh man, this this entire area is Ouch. Are these enemies slowing us? Another oblivion or sliver. Yeah, see, that's got a slightly different uh, attack animation. That's that's the difference between the the two weapon variants. Um, their their counter is different. Obviously, we don't have, uh... I'm saying this. Is it different? Where's the other one gone? Where'd you go? Any more to fight? That's typical, isn't it? In it. Ah, here we go. Fight. <laughs> um. The only problem with doing that is that I lost his loot, which is kind of annoying. Uh, was this just the way? Yeah, that's just the way back out. Um. Mm, Alright. So, I guess... Oh, there's you knew this was here right that will enable us to that'll bring it down first that will enable us to wall jump up it Incidentally, I am. It is well known that I am terrible at the wall jumping. There's a shiny over there. I wonder what you are. Water. Oh yeah, of course there's going to be water because Stasis Hollow allows you to walk on it. Of course, Havoc Shard. And. 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 Thank you. Right. 
was that? Oh, it's a bridge above us. Right. I guess then it's going to have to be something to do. Right. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. This makes plenty of sense so far. Uh, I guess we're just heading down here for, for now. Oh, look! A big friend! Dear Lord. Screw this. Take all of the havoc damage. Somehow that one random statue survived. I hear trickling water. Aha! Oh. Uh -huh. I, I still... Still, I'm hitting the wrong hollows. After God knows how many hours that I've put into this game. Alright. You're coming with me. Now this... Why, why do I want to freeze that one? That's the air one. Oh. I'm so stupid. Oh, balls. Oh, I've caused myself many a problem here. That was terribly timed. Sit down. Fragments. L loads of cash. Yeah. An arcane shard. Uh. Yeah, I think that was just a secret extra area to do some fighting in where we actually want to be going is over here. 
Oh. Nice. Ah, yes. Up on the bridge. And Vulgrim. Yeah, I assume that shiny that was there was to guide us to the correct path. Shoot me. I dare you. No? Okay then. Bye. Another small lurker cache. That was the way we came from. Anything hidden over there? No? No, oh, that's the way we came from. Now I'm confused. No, that's somewhere different. Hello? Friend? Oh! I'm really having to concentrate here. Gotcha. Right. So we've got... I am your end. I'm your end. Oh man, that does so much damage. That was surprisingly, uh, surprisingly easy to find. Um, large healing shard. I wonder why that's there. So, this is going to enable us to go two ways. First of all... Over here... Right, we want to get back there, don't we? Right, that's going to bring that over here. That's going to stasis it up again. 
That's going to... Gonna... What? Lol, what? Thank you. Uh, yeah, that didn't work. That's why. Whoa. Right, so that will enable me to hit that. That brings that block down. Ah, there's a thing up there. No, wait. That wants to be over here. And it wants to be icy. That gets me across there. That gets me across there. That gets me that. <laughs> Glad these respawn. That gets down there. Ba 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 bum. Right. Swinging. A lever. A handy, handy lever. A Vulgrim? Cheng. Uh... So now we have a bridge over here. Yeah. Uh, let's do this, shall we? I have got zero problems with using my habit form. Lots of fragments. Lots of fragments. Yeah, saw that coming. Uh, also saw that coming, technically. <laughs> when the, when you can get your dodge counters in with the uh, the force hammer, it is very satisfying indeed. And when you can't, you look like a complete idiot.
Nope. Suck it. Says the guy that uh, used up a good chunk of his health. Let's use a small healing shard. Right. Oh, that really doesn't heal much of anything anymore, does it? I suppose I shouldn't be massively surprised with that. Uh, no. I think not. You guys can get stuffed. An angelic artifact. Well, don't mind if I do. Totally how I meant to do that. <laughs> it's another puzzle. And... Clearly... Uh, at least there are no... Uh, oh, I shouldn't say this. But I'm gonna. At least there are no underwater enemies. There are, however, some blocks that look like they're going to come out of the wall. Um Are any of these going to be any good for stasis? Oh, I can. And jump up to there. Ha! Uh. Bravo to whoever designed these puzzles, incidentally. Uh. Hmm. Are we going to be able to... Ah, we can! Nice! Right, so this one can do fire. Fire. And wind. Yes, that's brilliant. Thank you for that camera angle. That was massively useful. Let's try this again. Right. Earth. Right. A much better camera angle and a handy lever what's that going to do ah now we can run over here Grab whatever's underwater because there's clearly going to be something. And. Right, there's a. Hmm. Oh, no.
Ah, ah, mm. Nope, that hasn't helped. Ah. Ah ha 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 ha. So, if I put the stasis hollow on... Yes! Good puzzle! Like it! Right, and that... Oh, yeah. Should probably uh, turn them all icy, shouldn't I? Ah. No, hold on. This isn't icy. It's on the wrong side. This, on the other hand, is icy. So we need to do some block reconfiguring. I don't think that's helped, has it? Isn't that just the same as it... No, that's the same as it was before. I'll just cycle through all of them. Right. So I'm going to have to... No, that doesn't work. That doesn't work at all. I need to get up there. Ah, I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you. That no. Then we send this one back. Yeah. 
Yeah. Then we get over there. Ba 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 bam. Uh. Yep. Once again, round of applause for whomever it was that designed the puzzles in this dungeon. They have been excellent. Not ridiculously over the top challenging, just fun enough that a little bit of thinking gets you to where you want to go. Now, speaking of getting where we want to go... And nope. <laughs> oh, we can get on top of this block. Never mind. I was thinking, can we get up there? I was going to fly over the top. And this, I'm assuming, is going to take us to the boss. Or maybe. Oh, boss time. Right. So, I wonder what he is going to have in terms of powers. You're a monster of few words, aren't you? That's me. <laughs> Splendid. We can skip the pleasantries and go straight to the reckoning. Jovox, keep of time. I am your end. Goes the fury. Ah, so it puts up us up here. That's nice and straightforward to get back. Nice. Good start. Good start. Let's start with this. So he's got a big timey bubble. I always frame that. Ow. Right, so those are kind of traps. Oh, I'm, I'm dodging far too early. Yeah, so those are traps. When he slams his foot down, and again...
I'm not very good at this. And that's going to kill me. Yeah. Thanks, Tooltip. Nice. Brilliant. So I need to time things wisely. I'm actually going to use some shards for this fight because I never use them. Um. Oh, you dumbass. No. When he puts his fist in the ground, wait before dodging. It's not hard. And yet I am making it look like some MLG... thing is having you know completed Sekiro and Bloodborne and Dark Souls 3 you know th this is nowhere near as challenging as that so it always annoys me You're not worth when I do stupid <laughs> stupid shit like that They've all got the same. Oh, <laughs> God damn it. I'm so stupid. I am so, so dumb. Mind you, I imagine it's quite entertaining to watch. But, oh god, this Demogen guy who does all the news for Darksiders 3, he's really bad at the game. Yes. Yes, he is. Oh, for god's sake. I'm just reading it wrong. Ouch! I have an itchy head. Right, this is going to take off a, a big chunk of my time. But it's also going to take off a big chunk of his health. So... I don't even care if it's cheesy.
You're not getting the better of me, Dovox, me old cocker. Taking you down. The pow. Science of scorn. Oh. Oh. Scythes, you say? Scorn becomes a reaping scythe, capable of splitting into two sickles at will while the stasis hollow is active. The scythe cuts through time and space, cleaving opponents on all planes of existence with a range of different attacks. Uh... Still can't use that unfocused veneration. Nice. Oh, now you see, I always had an issue with the sword uh, of Skull. I always felt it was a little bit iffy in terms of its uh, speed. But that feels a little bit faster. Either way. The four hollows? Oh my. Now we have all it takes to cleanse the serpent holes. I have. There is no we in I. Is that a saying? It is now. Just like if Vulgram is lying about the serpent holes, I'll wear his hat. He's probably lying. Oh, we are becoming fast friends, aren't we? Let's skip to the final wave of slaughter. Clearing the serpent holes and filling your pockets with booty. Or justice, whatever cracks you. <laughs> the final encounter. You are now granted passage into the final wing of the void. Access the void on the limbo tab. Serpent Holes menu. What would you ask of this? Take your time. Right, has he anything new for sale? No. An excellent choice. As you wish. As uh, you wish. Do make. Right, uh, we're not going to use. Sure they scream, horseman. I'm just gonna very quickly Greetings. Please take your time. Dark and Nebula. Eternium Spire. Is that where we go next? Um I just wanna quickly take a trip to the Maker's Forge to see if the reason why this um enhancement isn't working, if it's something to do with something back here. You can see whereabouts I am in the main story uh, on this Armageddon. A hammer be of all right. Let's see what I can do for you. Yeah, so we we can still upgrade it. Let me think it was possible. Let me think it was possible. Let me think it was possible. Ho oh, oh, ho! What beautiful havoc you'll wreak with that. Interesting. Interesting. It could be. All right. Let's see what that can do for you. Oh, interesting. I can upgrade these armors as well. I suppose that makes sense. I just not thought about it. I can upgrade the base ones as well if I need to. Aiming to lay down a mighty hurt, are we? Does he think it was possible? Does he think it was possible? Does he think it was possible? Ho oh, ho! Oh. What? Ho oh, oh. ho! Oh, oh. Some of my best. Some of my best work. So we've already got the edge up to plus ten. Interesting. I need more chunks. Need more chunks. 
Um, I'll do all that kind of stuff off camera anyway. So I guess... I guess... What would you ask? Please take your time. I'm just going to go to that one. I think Eternium Spire might be the one uh, upwards. Or maybe it was the one in the Stasis Hollow section. Don't know. Either way. It's time. To find out what's happening next. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this episode of Demogen Plays Darksiders 3 Keepers of the Void DLC. I hope... We will catch you all in the next one, which is going to be the final part, by the look of it. I'm excited to see what it's going to be. I'm assuming it's not going to be Wicked K again. Let's have a go, because we think we're hard enough. <laughs> and I'll see you all next time. Sure, yeah. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click the like button and subscribe. Remember to ring the bell notification icon to get notified when new videos go live. And until next time, toodle pip.